Hey guys, in this video I will show you how to quickly and easily create an account, deposit your money and buy any cryptocurrency on XT.com. To create an account on XT.com, you can simply go down to the video description, click on the link and then you get to exactly this page right here. You can choose your country right here. Just click on confirm and then you will get to this page right here and you can see the code is added so you get the 20% discount on all trading fees forever. Then you can just enter your details right here and you're ready to go. Alright, so once you have created an account and you log in for the first time, the page will look like this right here. And the first thing we have to do is to activate a second layer of security and to do that we simply go up here to our account and then we go to the security center. We actually, to deposit money, we have to use right here, as you can see, a two-factor authentication. In my case, I always recommend you just use the Google Authenticator, so if you don't have it set up, it's really simple, just download the app, and then you can set it up right here, and you will always get a code sent to your phone, so you have a second layer of security. And once you have done that, we can now deposit money. And to do that, we simply go up here to funds, and then we click on spot. This right here is actually the area where you can see all of your funds. You can also go back here to overview, then you will see all the different accounts that are available. In my case, always if you deposit something, just use the spot account with just the main account. So you simply go in here and then up here you can click on deposit. Now you can choose the currency that you want to deposit. So you can simply click here and choose for example Bitcoin. Then you can choose the network. In this case, let's just choose the normal official Bitcoin network. And once you've done that, you will get your Bitcoin address right here. You can copy that to your clipboard, send Bitcoin here, and then you have it on your account. This also obviously works for any other cryptocurrency. For example, I often use US dollar Tether. You can choose different networks. I, for example, like to use the Tron networks because it has low, very low fees. And then you get your address right here and you can send over the Tron network some USDT to your account right here. And as you can see, if I scroll down here, I've done that with a little bit over $100. And then you can see it arrived like if in a few minutes. All right, if I go up here, that's actually how you can deposit cryptocurrencies. Now I also want to show you how you can deposit money with fiat currency. So if you have US dollars, if you have ERA, you don't have crypto yet and you want to deposit money here, that's also possible. And to do that, you simply go up here, you click on buy crypto and now you have different options. I prefer to use the third party payment option. So if you click on that, as you can see, you can say now, okay, I want to spend, let's say, uh, 200 US dollars. And then you can obviously choose US dollar, but you can also choose, for example, if you search up here for euro, you can choose euro, you can search up for GBP if you use the British pound. So whichever currency you like, you can just simply select right here. Then you can choose what you want to receive. You can choose from all these cryptocurrencies directly, but you can obviously also just lo look for, for example, USDT and choose USDT, and then you can trade with it on here, of course. Um, in this case, let's just go for Bitcoin to demonstrate it's, it doesn't matter whatever currency you want to have on here. Then you can choose your payment method. So you can choose, for example, Visa card, MasterCard, Apple Pay. You can make a normal bank transfer via the SEPA network if you live in the European Union. And you can see Master is also an option, so or just a normal bank wire transfer. So whichever one you want to use, in this case, let's just go, for example, for Visa card, we have a Visa card, then just click on continue. And then you can see you have different payment options that you can use, which are also very familiar. For example, Simplex, Banksa, they're really popular. So you can just choose one of them, just click on confirm. You can also directly see how much Bitcoin you're getting in this case. Just click on confirm right here. And you can see again at what exchange price you're getting it. I can, you can click right here and click on continue. And then you will get to an option right here. So you can use your credit card or you can use the SEPA or SWIFT transfer. So a bank transfer, whichever one you would like. In this case, I want to use my credit card. So I can click on continue. And now I have to enter all of my card details right here. And then once I've done that, it won't take long until my funds arrive right here on my XC.com account. All right, so once you've made any deposit, you can always simply check that by just going up here to funds and then you click on overview and then you can see if you go into your spot account right here, if the money has already arrived and has been credited. All right, so once you have deposited any money right here, you can now use the, your deposit money, of course, to trade and buy and sell any cryptocurrency on the platform. And to do that, you simply go up here and click on markets. And then you can see all the different markets that you can trade on the platform, which are a whole lot. You have actually 800 trading pairs that you can trade on XT.com. And here we have to make sure that we are on the spot market in this case. We just want to trade one cryptocurrency for another, buy and sell. And then you can see all the different trading pairs that they have. I always prefer to use the USDT trading pairs. So if I want to buy and sell any cryptocurrency, obviously if you have some coin deposit, you can simply sell it right here for US dollar tether. And then with US dollar tether, buy 
any of these other coins. So with these trading pairs, you can basically get from any cryptocurrency to any other cryptocurrency and can, can trade them one for another. So in this case, I have already some USDT deposited as you've seen, and now I wanna show you how you can buy any cryptocurrency. So in this case, you can of course search right here for any coin, but in this case, let's just go for Ethereum, for example. We can just click on it and then you'll get to this page right here. You can also switch to dark mode, for example, if you prefer to use that. In my case, I like the dark mode a lot. And then you get to this page right here and I will show you now everything that you can see right here. So let's start off at the, at the top right here. Here you can choose your currency pair. So as you've seen, we have selected Ethereum USDT, but you can easily switch that right here if you wanna go to another trading pair. Then right below it, we have the trading chart. So the price chart that you can see right here, you can also get rid of some of these um, elements. For example, the volume profile, we don't need that. And as you can see right here, we have some moving averages. We can just get rid of them. So we just can see a clean view of the price chart right here. This is a cutout from TradingView, as you can see. So if you click on this little arrow right here, you can also, for example, draw into the chart if you wanna do so. Um, let's go back right here, or you can draw some lines. So you can do any of that as you are used to on trading view, so we can actually get rid of that again. And up here you can choose the different candles. So if you, right now we're on the 15 minute chart, so every candle is 15 minutes. We can go, for example, to the daily chart. Now every candle right here is one day. Um, right here on the right, we have the order book. So all the selling orders up here in the market and all the buying orders down here in green. Right next to it, we have the recently happened trades visible right here. And here at the bottom, we can see if we have some opened orders, we can see our order history, our trade history. And if you go to funds, you can also see what funds do I have available on my account right here. As you can see in my case, I have the 116 US dollar tether. And right here on the right side, this is actually very important. This is where we can make all of our trades. So where we can buy in this case, Ethereum and sell the cryptocurrency that we have chosen. Don't be confused by the spot and futures. We have spot selected right now here because we are on the spot market, obviously. Futures market is a different thing. If you want to try on that, you can check it out on my channel as well. So right now I want to show you how can I buy any cryptocurrency. I can see again here my available amount of USDT that I could use to buy Ethereum on here. Obviously, if you have some balance of the coin right here on the trading pair, you will see it here and you could use that to sell it for USDT. So right now, as you can see, I have 116 USDT. I can choose between a limit and market order. If I use a limit order, I could set a certain price at which I want my order to be executed. For example, I wanna buy some Ethereum, but this price right here for me is too high. I only wanna buy at, let's say, 1400. So I can type in here, 1400. And only if that price will be hit, then my order will be executed. But what I would always recommend you is just use a market order. If I click on that, as you can see, it says, at price, best market price. So then it will buy directly immediately at the current market price. So then you have a guarantee that your order will be actually filled because if you use this, it could happen that this price will never be hit and ju price just goes up. So you never have your order filled. If you use market trade, it will definitely be filled because it will be done immediately. So then down here, I can choose how much I want to buy. I could type in, for example, $100, or I could use the slider down here, which will choose how much percent of my available balance I want to use to buy. For example, I can choose that to a 100%, then I will use all of my balance and buy Ethereum. Obviously the same works for selling. You can say at the current market price, you can type in how much of your Ethereum balance you want to sell and then click, just click on sell. In my case, I wanna buy and all I have to do is just click down here on buy Ethereum and the purchase is completed immediately. Don't forget to create an account on xt.com by using the link down from the video description to get the 20% discount on all trading fees forever. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comments.